Doodle Bud thought I'd share with you today a very interesting fountain pen phenomenon, something I call a two penner. Now you're probably asking, what in the H E double hockey sticks is a two penner? I'll give you a hint. You might have heard of the expression a twofer, which means it's a slang term for a two for one. So you get a twofer, two for one. A twofer could also be a 24 of beer. You get a two four of beer. That's a flat of beer. Let's come back to the two penner. What does that mean? Well, here's the official definition. I came up with this today because it just happened. It's when you get two pens received on the same day or even better what happened to me at the same time. So I figured such a special and exciting occasion. It's a two penner. So hence the two penner. Now, of course, depending on where you're from in Canada, you would say it a little different. So if you're from Newfoundland, you just had yourself a two penner. In La Belle Province de Quebec, you would say a two-penner. In Ontario, you'd be talking all about your two-penner. If you're from Manitoba, I don't know, who really cares? If you're from Alberta, Saskatchewan, you just had a two-penner, eh, bud? And yours truly being a BC boy out in the West Coast, man, I just had a sweet two-penner. So there I was taking the dog out for the last pee of the night, and the postie, he's such a hard-working guy, saw him outside and he had a package i got kind of excited like oh sweet that's a new pen he goes well i got two for you and i thought oh my gosh that's wicked i just had a two penner so i'm not going to do a full review but i thought let's uh let's unbox these show you what i got coming down the pipe here thanks again i hit uh 4, subs so that's pretty cool thanks for all the support and uh so i just want to show you what i got coming there's a video coming out tomorrow morning this uh some classic classic packaging so this one here this i think this is the parker vector i ordered now the reason i got onto this one this was the uh, the parker vector was the first fountain pen i ever got had it in high school and uh i think i lost it or someone possibly stole it which happens and i kind of forgot about the pen for a bit but recently i've been watching doctor uh, dr john campbell sorry about that squeakies uh, dr john campbell uh, and he's from the uk and he does a fantastic job of just explaining what the hell's all going on with the pandemic with omicron and this variant and should you be taking oh boy taking this supplement or you saw this report he's a brilliant doctor also a teacher and uh on his talks he goes through some data and uh, takes some notes and I noticed he's got a red Parker Vector. So I thought I'd pick one of these up. This is the first. Mine was the all stainless when I first got it. But I thought, let's pick one of these up. You can't just buy these in the store. This came from India. And uh, but I think, I don't know, whatever it was, nine bucks or something like that. So uh, Dr. John Campbell, thank you for all the uh, work you're doing on making sanity out of this crazy time and explain it to us what the what's going on. And also, he's a fountain pen supporter, so check out his channel uh, as well. Uh, it's a good resource, especially with what's going on now. So, next one, this one, I believe, is the one... Uh, uh, here we go. A viewer asked me to review, and uh, there's a lot of pens people might mention, and I'm not overly interested in them. I saw this one, and uh, I thought, looks kind of cool. Turned it off for a second there. That tape was quite loud. So this one, um, I don't know how to say that other than Asvine, but uh, let's, <laughs> it's the the V169. Let's see what this pen is all about. It looks kind of cool, kind of kind of trippy. It's one of those pens where it looks like there's expensive versions of it, and this is the reasonable price variant. So uh, let's just show you this. Oh, that's heavy. Look, yeah, that, <laughs> that's a solidly heavy pen. Looks kind of cool. Is it screw cap or is it post? Is it snap cap? It's a screw. Oh, all right. Let's just see. I'm curious. Ugh. Okay. How does it even... That's a lovely feature already. That's going to be in the review. <laughs> Holy, can I even... There we go. Okay, that's a terrible design flaw before <laughs> I even got to get to the pen. Anyways, so yeah, uh, kind of a cool looking pen. There is a sneak peek on something I'm going to complain about already. But there you go. So I got the Parker Vector. Uh, 
Good little pen, very reliable everywhere around the world. And the old ass vine. What grows from the ass vine? Apparently this pen right here. So anyways, that's going to be coming up. And uh, to all everyone out there, maybe you've had a two-penner. Let me know which two it was. Have a good two-penner, eh, bud? You dirty two-penner.